Making his tea time, Scheffler did end up spending part of the morning at Metro Corrections. Wave News reporter Sean Bowdy breaks down what happened. It feels like such a surreal day here in Louisville. It started with such a tragic accident resulting in someone's death near Valhalla Golf Club. It ended with the world's best golfer in handcuffs right behind me inside LMDC. Just shy of 845 this morning, we saw the car carrying Scheffler pull out of Metro Corrections backwards, avoiding the gaggle of reporters standing outside the front. They backed out, drove off before driving Scheffler off at the golf course ahead of his 10.08 tee time. We'll litigate the case as it comes. Scheffler's attorney, Steve Romines, well known locally, says they're playing things day by day. We'll just let it all play out. That, that's the extent of what we know. LMPD says one person was killed walking across Shelbyville Road early this morning, later identified by the mayor as John Mills working as an outside vendor. While police were investigating the accident, an arrest report says Scheffler crossed over into incoming traffic, navigating through congestion. The citation goes on to say an LMPD detective tried telling Scheffler to stop and was allegedly drugged 10 to 15 feet by Scheffler's car, causing injuries. LMPD says the detective on scene was in full uniform and in high visibility rain gear. Scheffler says it's all a misunderstanding. He released a statement on social media saying it was chaotic and he thought he was doing what he was told to do. He goes on to express his deepest sympathies to the family of the man who passed away. Scheffler is due in court for arraignment on Tuesday right here in Louisville. Sean Bowdy, Wave News.